Hey, welcome back, everyone. How's everybody doing today? Today's footage, um, I'm going to be running the control here back and forth quite a bit um, to show you the way the light is playing in the sky. Um, it's plainly obvious once you actually see what's happening. So let's dive right into this and some exciting footage today. All right, here we go. Straight away, you can see that the sun is just sitting up there. Now watch it. It's moving sideways a little bit. And you notice that it's really not coming down, down. It's just sitting up there. See, now that's usually an indication that it's either behind something or setting behind something. Because then we're only seeing a point of light where the light is the brightest. Because when it's behind something, it's still coming out at somewhere being really bright. And we're going to show you a lot of that today. So, let's have a look-see. Because, I mean, right away, as the sun goes down, watch this. See how the light comes up and goes around something right here? Also, let's take this backwards a bit. You're going to see something here, something here. You see where the light's going around there, which you can see right there. See how the light's going under and around something here? There's also a cast shadow here, a cast shadow here. See those? And you can see how the light's going around something right here. See that? Get it at a little faster pace there. See what I was talking about? All right, let's head on over to a different location. This is looking at it in sunrise. Um, normally, we're watching sunsets from here, but I want to just, just see what it looked like. And as you can see, all the cast shadows and all the major light play. See all that? See how dark it is on the left there? See that? All right, let's look at sunset. This is a little better. As you can see, I mean, it's the same thing as before light is way over on the right you can see it's coming down and under something as the sun goes down it starts popping out on the other side of that something which is way over here and that's what that is see how the lights everywhere a lot more light over here still reflecting the sunlight from the Sun that went down all right let's look at this one this one's pretty interesting um, this over here is a dirty mark. Don't pay any attention to that. But what you want to pay attention to is this round cast shadow. Smaller one here. The light is breaking around something here. And also up here is illuminating the bottom of something else. I'm going to take you over to a different location. It's got a little better view. Not as dirty either. Alright, as you can see right here. Big round cast shadow. See how the light going down and around this? Also on this side. See how the light's bending around something right here? See how this area is remaining blue and blocking more light as the sun goes down? See how this reflected light? Now let's look at the other side, shall we? A lot more green over here, smaller, something above, reflecting light as well, as the light's pinching through. See where the light's bending here and catching over here. These are all reflection points of where the light is still 
hitting something there. And you can see the cast shadows. And over here as well. And right here. See that? You see all this over here? You can see, I mean, look at the light over here and the light over here. That is reflecting light off of other things still in the sky. See all the lights reflecting off of everything even after the sun went down? That's a whole lot of light reflecting back down at us. You see how the light's blocking? See how this light's just going around this, basically? Got the red right there. Got one, two, three, just like I did in the first footage. Look at the shadows already over here. Look at the shadows. As the sun comes down. Once again, all the shadows being cast onto the clouds from above. This wasn't really the best location, but it shows the planet, right? You see all the sunlight coming out of the above from, from above it? Now there's the planet, and there's the sun going down there, reflecting off of something really big and green over there, something red over here, and right in the middle, you can see the other. See that right in the middle? Got green, red, purple. I mean, yeah. Lots of reflecting colors up there. Uh, see how the light popped up from here all the way to the top? That's because it's going over the top of something. And that's why it's so round and bright up there. Because the sun is poking out from around that right there. All right. Now, the sun goes down over here. We all know that. Way over here to the, to the right. And this will kind of help show you what I'm talking about about something being over there you can basically see it right here this whole area I mean it looks like the Sun is coming down over here it's way over here this is what it's coming out from around the side of you understand you got something here you got something above it as well but it's coming out from around the side. And as the sun keeps on going down, and I know it still looks like it's right here area, but believe me, it's way over here. The light is coming out from around the side of what's in front of it. And that will become very apparent in about three seconds. Or four seconds five seconds <laughs> watch this see that see little sunlight's coming from way over here all the way down and around how awesome was that let's back up and watch it again <laughs> see how the lights playing the sun's way over here all of this light's coming from around the side of that planet. Let's pick up the pace of it a little bit. Shall we see that? All the light's coming from around the side. Boom! That's when it finally gets below the other planet and starts illuminating everything else in the sky. All right, next location. See this right here? That's that planet right there. See how dark it stays? Except for when there's clouds in front of it, then it really gets really bright. Okay, the sun is up. See? See how it's breaking the light, not allowing it to pass? See how dark everything is up in there until the sun gets low enough to actually start illuminating it from below. See how bright all that is? See that? 
See that? Come on. Sun goes down way over to the left, as you can see. And that is all reflecting sunlight up there off of something other than clouds. You can see it. Otherwise, what is up there that's reflecting so much light? Because it can't be clouds. They wouldn't be reflecting light. They'd be allowing light to pass through. And right here, see the shadow as the sun went down? See, that's the light coming out from behind what's right there. But it's also reflecting on what's behind right there and over to the right of that. See all that? All right, last location. Big shadow in the middle. There's the sun. Uh, see all the lights coming out from around here? This is all sh shadow. There's that little one. There's the bigger one. Here's the bigger one even still blocking light. See that? All the clouds are shaded up in there. And you can see quite a bit in that. And you got red on the left, and you got green on the right, and you got yellow in the middle. See how all that's playing the way it is? It's because this is reflecting light off of what's there. See, the sun came down from up here, went down behind what was here, as you can see the big round shadow that was actually there. All right, epic it was. Uh, I hope everybody could understand what I was talking about. If not, I'm not the best at it. <laughs> it's hard to sometimes express what I'm seeing as well. But you can see that the light was bending around a lot of things. Staying in the sky and then all of a sudden at the bottom or all of a sudden at the top of the screen. That's showing you that there's something in the way other than clouds. I mean, what are those big round cast shadows otherwise? All right, everyone. Have a great day. Please share.